Hey you guys, it's me Jess and I'm back again with another video. I wanted to do another all healthy um, vegetarian Aldi's haul. Um, I told you guys in the last video that I do my weekly grocery shopping on a Sunday and that's the day I go to Aldi. Sometimes I might do something quick somewhere else if they have something I really want. But these are the things that I have for the week. And, and actually, there's a few things on here that are from Sprouts that I'll show you in a minute. But anyways, um, what was I going to say? Um, yeah, so I do my weekly grocery shopping um, every Sunday. And I just want to start making these videos just so you guys can see how easy and inexpensive it is to eat healthy. Um, There are some things I have that might not be that healthy, but they're not even for me. But we'll talk about that in a second. So, um, and I will go through, let y'all know how much these cost. And some of these things, some of these items are a sale. Some of them are regular price. And I'll let you guys know that as well. Um, And also... Prices do vary at different Aldi's. It's not going to be, I mean, it, uh, sometimes it could be as big as 50 cents, but the prices do vary um, as much as 10 cents to 50 cents, depending on the, the Aldi's location. So, um, yeah, so let's get started. I want to make this a pretty um, quick video. And um, and also, just so y'all know, um, we already have a lot of things on hand already. So these are just the things I want to have for this week. Um, but there are certain things like pasta, some different vegan meats, sauces, seasonings that we already have, beans, rice. So there's certain things I don't have to buy all the time, but these are just the things that I normally, I just want to have for the week. And then there's some things here that we might not even get to this week. So that will probably, you know, I will have for a little while. But anyways, so um, if you remember last week, I got blueberries. The, blue, the blueberries are actually cheaper this week. It's still a pint and these are $1.29. Um, which I thought was a really a great deal for the whole pie, and you can see it's pretty big, and they're real, and they're all fresh. Um, the last ones I got last week, I did freeze those already, and I'm using those for smoothies. This one, I might just freeze one of them and keep the other one just to snack on, or we might just snack on both of them. I'm not sure. So, but yeah, a dollar twenty nine for each pint. Then we have here the sixteen ounce strawberries, and these were a dollar and seventy nine cents each, which I thought was also a really good price because. Lately, I've been seeing the strawberries pretty expensive, so I was actually shocked when I saw that these were a dollar and thirty nine cents, and they're all fresh, nice and juicy. So this was also a good deal. So I decided to get two of them. I already have a bunch of frozen strawberries, so these will probably just be snacking on. So these, I'm not sure if I'm freezing for some of these. I think we're just gonna eat these. So, all right. So for Jacob's lunchbox, we got some more applesauce. This is a strawberry one. I still have some from last week, so I just brought one. And as you can see, no high fructose corn syrup. And these, you get six cups, and these are a dollar and thirty-five cents. They're just as good as Mott's, and half the price. So here's some yogurt for Jacob, his favorites. I got the blueberry, strawberry, peach, cherry. Some of them I got in light, um, because those are the only, cause those flavors he liked. They didn't have the light strawberry and cherry, so I just got the original. But anyway, those are thirty-two cents. But that is the regular price all the time. And just so y'all know, the strawberries and blueberries, that is a sale. That's not the regular price. That the, the prices for the blueberries and strawberries will vary from week to week. The applesauce, that is a regular price. Okay, Um, I last week I told, showed y'all I had gotten these brown rice crackers. I got the peppercorn. This week I got the peppercorn and I, I got the tomato basil. They didn't have any more of the roasted red peppers. So I'm really interested to try these. These are really, really good. These are $1.99 at regular, regular price. They're very delicious. They're a great healthy snack to eat on its own you can have a slice of cheese or you can dip it in hummus and as you can see they're non-gmo verified and they're gluten-free and vegan and only a dollar 99 for the box okay so we got some cinnamon raisin bagels um jacob loves these and these are only a dollar 49 you get six bagels and they are very very good so just as good as lenders or those other bagel companies and you're not even paying and i think pepperidge farm whoever else makes bagels and they're very inexpensive. I've seen other bagels for like four or five dollars. These are only a dollar for night and they're very delicious. To go on the bagels, we have some um what's it called new new chatel cheese. It tastes it's supposed to be um similar to cream cheese, but um like not as fatty, so and a lot lower in calories. This was only sixty five cents. So I was actually shocked because at my location, I told you I went to another Aldi. The one that's closer to me normally sells them for ninety-five cents, but they it was sixty-five cents at this location, which I thought was pretty good. Okay, so here I've got ten mangoes. The mangoes are on sale this week for thirty. Was it thirty-nine cents? 
each, which is a great deal. So I got 10 of them. All right. So that is not a regular price. That is a sale. Sometimes it can be as much as a dollar a piece, but they're 39 cents this week. If you like mangoes, I would suggest you go and get some like ASAP because the sale ends on Tuesday. Okay, so these are for Jacob. This is the um, Texas Toast. This is only $1.25. He loves spaghetti and he loves to eat um, garlic bread with the cheese on it with his spaghetti. Not the healthiest choice, but it's not like something that he eats all the time. I'm not really a big garlic bread fan. Um, I mean, I, I really I really don't eat it like that, to be honest with you. I, I, if I eat spaghetti, I can just eat it by itself with some veggies. So, All right, then here we have some French toast sticks. I just got this for him this time because I just thought this would be a really easy, quick breakfast that he could make in the morning. So he could just throw it in a toaster oven himself. And this is only $1.79 for the box. And you get... How many do they give you? Does it say... I'm not sure how many you get. I think you get about 20 sticks. Because it says a serving is five and it said four servings. So I think you get about 26. That was only a dollar seventy nine cents, which is really good. And since we're talking about the French toast sticks, I'll just go ahead and talk about the syrup. I got the light maple syrup. That was a dollar and um twenty-nine cents. Here I got some broccoli, Jacob's favorite vegetable. I have to get broccoli every single week. I should have gotten two because he loves these. But anyway, these are like a dollar and forty-nine cents. Um, for the broccoli crowns, which is really good because trust me, I've gone to see markets and seen broccoli a little bit more expensive, so that was really good. And I just normally saute that in some olive oil and garlic, it's really good. All right, spinach for salads and smoothies, these are $1.19 a bag. I think I had that in my last video. Um, the organic um, baby carrots, these are really good. Um, I wanted to get this this week to eat with the hummus as opposed to the pretzels, I didn't get pretzels this week. These were $1.29 for the bag really great deal this um you guys know i love veggie um ravioli i talked about it in the last video this is a spinach and mozzarella ravioli it's only two dollars and 49 cents for nine ounce if you get refrigerated ravioli at other supermarkets you're going to pay way more you might pay about four or five dollars these are 249 and that is a regular price also the spinach and broccoli that's also regular price carrots so so far the only things i've discussed so far that's on sale are the strawberries the blueberries and the mangoes those are the only items that um right so far that is a sale item that can vary from week to week okay another favorite of ours is baby bella mushrooms that's it's kind of like a meat replacement for us and we just love it and mushrooms are really good for you these are only a dollar 49 each so i went to go ahead and got two my location they're like a dollar 89 so i was really shocked that they were dollar 49 this and that's i don't think that's a sale for them i think that's a regular price so i went ahead and got two um so we sometimes we fry them we saute them throw them in pasta whatever so baby bella mushrooms are really, really versatile. Even if you want to make veggie burgers from scratch, marsh, mushrooms are really good, you know, to use as a base. So um, that was really good. I've um, got some green grapes. These are so tasty and crispy. They're not soggy at all. These were $1.49 a pound, and this is like four pounds, almost four pounds worth of green grapes. I think I paid about four dollars and change for that. But yeah, they're really tasty. I had already tasted them in the store, so they're really good. Again, almond milk and coconut milk. I didn't realize that I picked up the unsweetened vanilla. I really meant to pick up the original. But anyways, um, it doesn't matter. We'll just eat it with our cereal because I have a lot of organic cereal. So this will probably not last anyway. So we've got the unsweetened vanilla almond milk. This is $1.65. The coconut milk is $1.99. Okay. Then this I was really excited about. This is a Priano spinach and cheese ravioli. This is a frozen one. I got two of them. These were $1.69. They were ringing up at $3.99, which was a mistake. I'm going to tell you all right now at Aldi's, make sure that you, you pay attention to the prices. Take pictures if you have to because sometimes you're always going to have maybe one or two items that ring up wrong and you have to make sure you're paying attention because they the cashiers move very fast at Aldi's. They swipe the stuff so fast. So you better make sure that you're paying attention because if you catch it, you could say, hey, you know, that's not the right price. Go and show it to them or go take a picture and they'll have to change it. Um, and if you don't get a chance to do that, always check your receipt. If there's a mistake, get back online and get your money back, okay? And you guys know from last week, these are so delicious. I had to get more. I actually bought two bags this time. This is the, um, the Journey to India Tandoori Barbecue Wave Potato Chips. Very, very delicious. So delicious. They're $1.79 a bag. So I had to get some more. And guys, this is my Aldi's haul. Oh, I also got more of the mango dried mangoes for 256 but i already ate those so anyway everything here up to here um is 54 dollars at all these which i thought was pretty cool 
And especially since I won't be back at the grocery store for the rest of the week. Okay, this is some stuff I got from Sprouts. I just wanted to share this with you guys real quick since it's already on the table. This is the um, oatmeal. This is rolled oats. And this is the quick oats. They have a bulk section where you can scoop up your own stuff. These were 99 cents a pound. So I actually paid less than a dollar for each of these. And this is oatmeal, okay? So that was really good. And their organic one is only a dollar forty nine. So... Then you got the two pound bag of cuties. These were a dollar ninety eight cents, which I thought was really good. Of course, I'm not a big cuties fan, but my son is. He loves cuties. I think these are like his favorite snack. Believe it or not, I actually bought three bags of these, and there's only one left. And I bought these last night, so he ate two bags in a day, which is crazy. All right, here we have. Um, I love grapefruit, and this is the pamplemousse, um, grapefruit. So, and I thought this was a great deal at Sprouts. These were three ninety nine for the bag which I thought was amazing. I would have bought two, but I was like, you know, let me at least try these. I haven't had pample mousse in a long time. So, um, grapefruit, but I don't know if I've had the white one. So I was like, okay, let me just try these out. So I think I get about oh, is it? one, two, three, four, five. Okay. Seven of them, which is pretty good. And these are some vegan um, cheese puffs I love. I actually bought two, but I ate the other one already. Um, the other one I have with the, Bru the Brussels sprout puffs. And these were like two for five, okay? So, guys, this is it. This is the end of the haul. Just wanted to share that with you guys that you can get some really great items um, and not really pay a lot of money. And, of course, there's some things that I have staples that I don't have to buy all the time, like rice, beans, I already always have on hand. Well, anyway, that's it, you guys. I hope you guys enjoy. Um, please subscribe and like share and i will see you comments of course and i will definitely respond and i'll see you guys in the next video bye